guys what is going on it is me nunreezy and i'm actually gonna be showing you how to manipulate the thumbnail templates that i did make myself yesterday for y'all um I, I put downloads for them you can make them but i'm scared that some of y'all do not actually know how to manipulate them and use them as your own so i'm gonna be showing you how to manipulate them in two different programs one in photoshop and one in um paint.net um i already made a um a file so uh, or a, a little uh, document so basically what you're going to do is, in paint.net it's a free program um, I'll actually be leaving a link if you want to download it yourself I'll be leaving a download link for that in the description below um, you can go to the link and download it yourself um, so basically you just go to new and then I just did 1920 by 1080 because that's the um, template size that I made um, so you would just do that and you see it made it right there um, but I'm going to exit out of that all right, so once you do have that, um, I'm pretty sure in this program you can just drag, click and drag. So I'm just gonna click and drag this and then paste it on here. I'm gonna click add layer and see it's already right here, okay? So it's on a template or on its own layer by itself. You can uncheck it to make it disappear. So basically what you wanna do is, I'm gonna go ahead and click the plus sign right down here and make a new layer, third layer. And I'm gonna delete this background layer so it's a transparent background. And um, basically what I'm going to do is, I'm going to get a clip, um, a photo, um, I'll just, uh, let me go to Google Images real quick, and I'm just going to type in um, American flag, t or 1920, 1080, and then I'm going to go to Images, and I'm just going to click on this photo right here, the American flag, right click it, save image, desktop, save it whatever and this is going to be just an example you don't have to you don't have to do that yourself um actually it just made its own layer i forgot it did that so i can just delete that and i'll just drop that down for those the bottom layer so now um pretend that this american flag i'm using it as a symbol of what my video is going to be about so if my video is going to be about the american flag i just put a picture of american flag as the back layer 1920 to 80 and then i have the template right here overlay template that i made made for y'all and um, basically I'm just gonna do the little text tool I'm actually gonna click over here um, the font is actually super small so I'm gonna throw it at 200 and just see where it goes from there okay that is a little too big so I'm gonna do about 175 and I think that should do it for us I'm gonna drag it over here yeah okay so let me find a more attractive different um, photo or font I mean I don't know I said photo um, let's do let's actually do the big noodle okay so I'll just type in American flag doc no yeah no I'll just do American flag okay I think that'll be fine and um, I'm gonna use this little grab tool click and drag kind of center it up a little bit more than that all right and now I'm gonna um I don't even know how to do there we go font okay that's the color actually can I center it up like that okay there we go that's a little bit whatever I don't know how much changed but that is that that's basically how I was meaning this template to go through not in the sense okay so let's do another example actually all right so that this is what my top my video is gonna be about it's gonna be over the American flag or just anything like that um let's think of another uh thing Let's do Clash of Clans wallpaper. 1920, 1080. Okay, well, if I was going to do a video over Clash of Clans, what I would do is right click, save, you know, do the same thing, same thing. Come over here to paint.net. Click add layer. And then, whoops, wait, where's it? Where'd it go? I'm going to click and drag it again. Hold on, I guess it didn't go through or something. It's not like working. Hold on. What the heck's going on, man? Hold on, can I, um, they don't have like a paste tool, that's kind of weird. You can just like paste the photo up. Uh, okay, there we go. Alright, so there it is. So, my video is going to be over, um, I don't know, uh, something like, uh, um, something along the lines of Clash Clans, obviously. I would just grab this template, whichever one, I'll grab the blue one this time. And I'm going to drop it, add layer. So there we have that. We have the little bar that's, uh, that states our our um, title. 
and we'll do um, we'll do farming. Uh, this is this is class clans talk here. Um, I guess I need to I need to drag this layer on top, and I'll type in farming farming uh, trophies, and then basically all you have to do from here is click save save as click the paint.net save as file type and do either PNG yeah do PNG that's what I normally do mine so do it and then farming trophies put it as the title click save um, I just just do the default things flatten you know flatten the image make it all one layer and then what do you have it you have it right here photo farming trophies that's your thumbnail so when you do go to upload your your photo or upload your video just click add thumbnail and there you go you have your little cover photo which is things along the lines of this like RC7 cracked this is the um, video I did last time so if you are fairly new to Photoshop you don't quite know how to um, manipulate photos in the sense of thumbnail templates um, I just went to file new 1920 to 80 same settings as I did in the other program I'm gonna add a new um, layer because I always just delete the background one to make it transparent now I'm gonna go to file and place because for some reason in this program um, I have to uh, place them instead of just click and drag so basically I just placed it I want to make sure that the template does fill the whole um, sides every side for some odd reason it's a little offset so there we go we fixed that and um, we're gonna we're gonna place our Clash of Clans photo and it's basically the same exact steps as we did in the other one it's it's fairly simple um, it's just some people don't don't understand or don't know so I just wanted to clarify with y'all I know this probably will be pointless for most of y'all but anyone that's trying to um, you know make a YouTube channel um, I'll drag that top layer make sure if you if you're like your words aren't popping up make sure that the um, text layer is above the other layers make sure it's on top and then I'll make this look a little bit more um, attractive I'll right click I do, do the layer style I just add a stroke um, maybe a stroke of one would look best no three would probably yeah three was probably the best keep it at black let's do a little bit of a drop shadow um, let's add a gradient uh, overlay and we'll do um, if we want to do rainbow we could um, or if we wanted to make our own uh, we could just right click click color and do whichever photo so if I wanted to uh, do that photo or that color and then on this one I could do uh, the other color actually that looks ugly um, yeah there we go that looks pretty alright looks decent and then maybe I'll change the stroke color to white uh, that looks alright yeah sometimes that makes it look better yeah that made it look a little better so there you go and that's how you manipulate so then basically you want to do file save as I'll do desktop and then click on the Photoshop file type and um, PNG as well uh, I have a folder for all of my thumbnails so I would just save it to that so basically I'll just do desktop and I'll do farming trophies 2 and save ok minimize that and uh, what in the world is that it might be on my other desktop or on my other uh, oh, I gotta find it oh there it is yeah it's, right, it's still right here <laughs> um, right click it, it makes it look a little weird I don't know the way this um, program is what I open the files with or open the pictures with it makes it looks make it look like it's look it looks different so if I wanted to open up in photos maybe it'll look different or look better yeah that looks way way more clean so there you go guys that's how you manipulate them and then basically I don't I hope I don't have to show you all I'll um, show you all an example if you don't know how to show or post your thumbnails to your um, videos basically just click upload um, I'll just paste um, one of my videos um, exploit talking random stuff I'm obviously not going to keep this video and you basically custom thumbnail right here 
and there's a max file size of two megabytes so do not go over that okay um, there's actually a recommended I didn't even see that there's actually a recommended of 128720 that's probably why sometimes my things doesn't fit all the way but okay and then you basically go to desktop or wherever you saved your things and then just pick whichever one you do so I, I like this one and this is what it, the video is going to be about farming trophies too so I upload it every once in a while it shows an error for me I don't know why I think it's because I like click the thumbnail thing too fast but see so yeah it says no file chosen but it's there it's all good see this is all my thumbnails right here so I would just pick um, exploit talk I probably have that thumbnail somewhere in here if I can find it um, yeah cuz I like have like all of my thumbnails still um, let me look exploit talk exploit talk and other stuff yeah this is the the photo the thumbnail that I used on this video the actual video Yep, there it is, and then that's the cover photo. All right, so I hope y'all did enjoy this. If you did learn anything, please leave a like. I would greatly appreciate that. Um, I hope I didn't do this for no reason. I know that some of y'all didn't understand. I would assume. Um, I know nobody like knew these videos were gonna come, but I just wanted to do it because I knew that people in the past wanted them, because um, they they were inspired and want to make their own channel. So I hope I hope that happened, and I hope y'all did enjoy, guys. I really do. Um, have a great night. Peace.